thought about it all day today. The world we know is about to waste away. On both sides and in between, we're seeing things that we've never seen. Out in a piece of paradise, it's turning out to be not so nice. In a world so full of greed, do we fight? Do we just concede? Me and Frank are on our way to Beaver High School. This is not a place that many people are ever allowed to investigate. The client's currently turning this school into his own home. He calls it his fortress of solitude, which I think is pretty cool. Say hi, Frank. Hey, yo. <laughs> this is the gym. Look at that. That is so cool. We're getting a walkthrough right now. Is this to the basement? Yeah. It is. We'll do a quick walkthrough of like the office yeah. first. Uh, yeah, we we'll got the office and the ball. Cool. So this was the old teacher's uh -huh. in the office slash ball area. That was the assistant principal's office and then they had their own bathroom in there. And of course this is the cubby room. At one point a gentleman uh, did a lot of work in here. And then he just walked away from it. This is the barrel wall safe, all wrought iron. Of course it used to be the Board of Education, which is why the way gentlemen came to check the mail. Um, it's cool. It's got a little feeling in here. There's a present. Stick that in there, the 360 and whatnot. I felt energy when I went in. Is it going? 4.4. 4.4 on the mail? 4.4. A point four on the mail? Uh-huh. Gotta get a feeling here too. Point three. I'm very sensitive. Point four now. They might be detecting some, you know, power that's still currently thrown to the building. It's possible. Right, right. Um, but I'll tell you right now where you're at. You are in a room that there's no way on God's green earth that energy could pass through that. Just like natural that we pass, you know. So you the walls are four and a half feet thick. You got uh, any kind of spirit box rocking right now? Oh yeah. If anybody's here with us, can you tell us your name? Right there with something. Now most of those responses, we won't be able to tell what it said until we review. But clearly it responded right away. Oh, K2. 360 is going off and the K2. This is 360, this is K2. Tom. Hey. Did it say Tom? Yeah, Is that somebody you know? It said Tom twice. Oh, yeah. Is that someone a name familiar? Mm -hmm. I like that. This is the 360 right here. We're getting hit. Hey, Tom. Hey, Tom, what did you do here at the school? What was your job here? What was your connection, Tom, to the school? Who's in the basement? There's something there. In the electrical mechanical room, there will always be energy flowing through that even more. Right. The rest of My theory on this, spirits will congregate and tend to be in that area where the energy is. I've heard that before. Yes. Yeah. So is that power box live or? Um, this, it, to the right, to the right when you go up, it opens up to the street. To the left is the radiator system. Basically what you're walking into is just one big vent. So we're in the basement right now, in the Fortress of Solitude. This is the boiler room. I had three of the boilers removed. I, I may have maintained one of them. But uh, like I said, he cleaned, it, he cleaned a lot of, he hauled, he hauled about nine skips out of here. Yeah. Go. This goes to the, extra, to, uh, to the street level. So yeah, we're totally in the basement. Yeah, and this water is a new entity of something, a renovation we did, and now we got to port something different. Yeah. We're going to definitely have to accommodate it for a winter. Point five. Point five. Seven. Oh, that's the box. Yes, sure is. Is that on? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, my goodness. Basically, every floor is a carbon cop. Both of these rooms, they're safe to walk in, but they have damage. That one has a very significant amount of debris. Any kind of activity on this floor? Uh oh, it just said something. 
Uh oh, it just said something. Uh oh, it just said something. Oh my gosh, look in here. Look at this balcony. This is the gymnasium. Is anybody with us in the gymnasium? About every 20 minutes or so, in certain periods of time, something that sounds a whole lot like footsteps starts right there at the tube and then works all the way around. And then it comes this way? Oh, it never crosses the front? No, it goes there, comes around, and comes there. And it's so oh, loud. Oh, it comes all the way around I here. I might find that out, okay, when I had some friends come in. We were down there one day. We have music playing. I had a Bose stereo system sitting right there. We heard it. So we unplugged that. I even come and unplug the refrigerator. And sure enough, we follow it pretty yeah. loud. And so 20 minutes later, sure enough, it restarted from there. It doesn't come back. It starts from there. It goes around here. We did think we heard it become about halfway and then stop. It must be residual then. I think everything is residual. In the my, personally, that's my belief. When it, if it gives us an EVP, then that's intelligent. There is something that came through here when it's all silent and everything. Everyone that's here seems to have a good time. Yeah, we're getting 360. That was the home economic lab. You have to get them out of kind of construction type stuff that's been going on there. ROTC on this side. It's kind of landlocked, but you can access that room there from that room. From what I've heard in the past, someone likes to hang out in this room. Oh, in there? Mm -hmm. They like to hide now. They don't think it's I kind of feel a little bit in there. Who's in here? You don't stay here, do you? You tell me go in here when people are here and you're just hearing me, right? Uh, these people, they're good people. They're stories and Frank. And I'm allowing them to come through the building and try to talk to y'all. They just want to communicate with y'all a little bit. And you know how I always enjoy hearing uh, what these people come back with to, uh, to tell me? It's a trick. Oh, no. <laughs> Trip. Oh yeah. Okay. Okay. Wow. Oh my goodness. Beautiful. Any spirits in here? We got point two. Who's in here? Oh, so something. You turned on up. The female said hi. Adult. 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 Adult female. Hi. Who's here with us? Wow. You call this the sound room? This is a, like a, the amphitheater. What do you call it? <laughs> Who's in here? What are you here for? This is too cool. So this is like, what do they call it, the theater? Oh, look at the ceiling. It's so beautiful. The noise is really carrying here, so we'll have to be like real quiet. I use this little camera because it's really good at picking up EVPs right on it. Yeah. Well, see, I just felt uh, something come up to me right now. The big, the big black chair there. No, I just felt like a cool breeze something come up to me. Let me turn this back on. Oh, 
So who's in this room? Can you tell us your name? Oh, you're more than welcome to paint something. Want to show you where the paint is? Oh, really? Yeah. Come here. Positive and negative energy. The red being negative, the green being positive. Can you show them the, the uh, grid? Oh, the laser grid? Oh, that's the, you know what it is? It's this light. Oh, look at it going. <laughs> it's going now. <laughs> Does anybody here want to talk to us? Oh, okay. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah. Anybody want to say something before we shut this off? These sixties going off. Oh, we'll leave it on. Everywhere it's safe to walk in separate ways, we don't have to. It's all incredible. This is your studio. Wow. I'll bet. I'll bet you get a gorgeous, bet you get a gorgeous, bet you get a gorgeous. Oh, it said something. Mark. Who's Mark? Who's Mark? Oh, up in there. Oh, I'll bet you something's in there. I feel it. Something's in that room. I have no power in there. No energy in the power. You can feel there's something in that room. You need to see this, though. What's that? Uh, the, the slide. The slide? Uh, what, like a quick evacuation slide? Uh, can you say that? Yeah. And I've never noticed this in my life. It says date coming. Never noticed that. I've never noticed it says gate. Have you ever noticed it says gate on it? Gate. Gate. Too street. Wow. <laughs> oh my god, this is the fire escape. Uh -huh. Where does it go from up there? All the way to the street level. Oh. Too low to put a trailer underneath. Oh my oh, god. Let's have an experiment. That's the gate. And you're welcome to this too. I don't care. And we'll just it. Been a long time no see, Frank. Are you doing all right? You still like hanging up in here? Or do you prefer the basement now? Up here? Yeah, me too. I'll be just right up here. Ask you who, who likes to stay in there, because I can feel somebody's in that. Does anyone like to stay in the projection booth? I've never known anybody. Who stays in that projection booth? Do you like to go in there? Put him. Put him. Is that cool? My name's Joy. This is Frank too. Also.
Hello? But they're going to be here for a long, long time. So, uh, you know, whatever you want to say. I appreciate you taking me for reading that book, too. It was my pleasure. What was the name of the book? Treasure Island. Oh, wow. Treasure Island. You're welcome. Right. I'm going to show you a couple of the highlights and then y'all do your thing. Um, 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 um. So cool. uh, this right here is the brickwork that you want to utilize. This is this is what get polarized. What do you mean? Oh, the... Um, it has an electrical charge at 2 o'clock in the morning. You know, uh, go ahead. That's it now. You won't see nothing. Try to 2 to 220 in the morning. Did you hear that? What is that? What's associated with this wall? Energy. What's with the wall? Is anybody attached to this wall? Do you remember what I told you about the line? Do you remember what I told you about the line? You remember what I told you about the line, right? Yeah. The gold right. line. Because you said the range is set on this line. Right. Mm -hmm. I believe, and yeah. This goes directly probably to limestone. Of course, limestone is... Conductive. Of course, my opinion is that the pyramids were actually power plants. And they, and they were insulated with limestone. Yeah. And, the, and then the water that runs through it like a battery. So when I go downstairs, I'm going to turn on the surface of the building, correct? Yeah. You want to kill it? Yeah. Yeah. That'll work. Too. That's right. We're going to the water fountain. The little girl had it. The aneurysm. Is it like straight above us? Or yes. So? It's, it's top of the stairs. The water fountain right away. We're going to get stop the stairs. Okay. And in 1976, uh, someone died from that rope. That's why they're cut. Fell and broke her neck in gym class. Wow. In 1976. I know the name. 76. Let's see if y'all get it. Yeah. And the rest of the road is in this room right here. What is the name of the girl who fell from the rope in this gymnasium? Tell me your name. Can you tell me who you are? Are you with us? Both the same day, the custodian grabbed the rope, cut it off. Both of them, huh? Yes. We're in the gymnasium. We're hearing little noises, like dripping. Ooh, I just saw something. I actually just felt something on the side of me. I felt something right here. Who am I smelling? A girl died from that rope up there, and when I turn this on, you should be able to talk through the white noise. How old were you? Can you tell me your name? Here's Tony. Um, it's not letting the focus very good. What's the girl's name who died on that rope up here in the gymnasium? You hear that noise? I hear it. I hear it while I wrote it. Over here? Over here? Uh -huh. That's the rope. Let's sit quiet. Can you make a noise in here? We're hearing little noises. 
like dripping. Oh, just spilled the battery. Boom, shakalaka. Got it? Right, we got everything in here. Uh -huh. Who's that? Hmm? Oh, that's the one. If anybody's here with us, can you talk to us? I keep hearing a whistle. Are you hearing it? I heard something long ago. Like a whistle? Yeah. Like that? Yeah. Like that? Yeah. Like that? Yeah. Who said that? Can you tell us your name? Turn this on low. Hello? Hi. My name's Joy. I'm sorry. You want to talk to us? Yeah, hi. What's the name of the girl who died on that rope? Can you tell me your name? How old are you? My name's Joy, and this is Frank. Hey. Do you want us to go upstairs? Here we come. Hello. Anybody in here? Hello. Is this where the bank vault is? Who's watching that money? Anybody want to tell me your name? What was that? What was that? Not you? No, I heard that with my own ears. I think I can hear you. Who's who's got all that money in the bank vault? Did you go to school here? Were you a student? We're gonna go up on the second floor now. Can you come out by us? What's that girl's name that died in that gymnasium? On the rope. What's her name? How old is she? This, this, this is the water fountain.
Oh boy. Can you slam a locker door? Something touched me. Something touched me. Something touched you? Where at? Could be this right here. What what did you feel the touch? She said touch. Anybody here want to talk to me? Can you show yourself? Can you talk to me? Did anybody go to school here? Okay, I'm in total darkness. We are on the second floor. This is where the little girl died at the watering fountain. Oh, we're getting 360. It's on the 360. Who's here with us? That's me. Can you talk to us and tell me your name? What's your name? These things will light up for you. We're gonna, oh look it. Tribal meter or the periscope. Getting hits on the periscope. Ooh, look at it. Mm -hmm. Oh, who was that? Can you tell me your name? Can you talk to me? If you come by me, I'll be able to see that you're here by lighting up some of these lights. Oh, look at the ceiling. It's too hard to decipher that eventually. Nothing here will hurt you. Can you touch me? Is anybody in there? Can you show yourself? I said anybody in there said me. <laughs> Who's me? Let me see ya. Show me yourself. Frank, it said. It said Frank. You know who Frank is? Uh, this here with me, this guy's name is Frank too. What's your name? Ed, did you hear that? I heard that. Hello, my name's Joy. Yeah.